one James from Chaosium. I sat down with Jeff Richard the other day and we spoke about some of the great projects that Chaosium is working on behind the scenes. I'm going to jump over to that interview in just a moment, but first, please subscribe to the Chaosium YouTube channel. It helps us a lot and it lets us make more content like this. Enjoy the interview. Sure. I mean, I work on, I, I, I generally work on several projects at the same time. So right now, what, what eats up most of my, my time is I am starting the art process on the RuneQuest uh, Sartar box set. I've got to say, I've got to say that carefully because um, uh, the Sartar box set and the Startar, uh, starter set uh, trip over one's tongue pretty quickly. But I'm, I'm uh, working already on the, uh, the art process on that. We've got quite a bit of art that we are doing on that, but we've got some amazing artists lined up um, and, and working on some additional maps for that uh, book with uh, Matt Ryan. Matt did that giant, amazing um, uh, Dragon Pass detailed map. And that's going to be in the, the, the starter book. And then I'm working with uh, Luik and Agatha Pate to uh, finish up the art for the, uh, the Colts book. Uh, and then I am writing the uh, RuneQuest campaign book. So this is the overall campaign guide for that brings you through the Hero Wars. So this starts with, has you start right after the Dragon Rise and uh, gives you the overall arc all the way to the end of the third age. Um, so if it, you know, sort of uh, the, the equivalent of the boy king uh, for Pendragon, but this would be for, for RuneQuest. And then I'm also working with uh, David Larkins on the new edition of Pendragon. So I think between, between those, that's what I'm working on on the role-playing game side. And then I'm working with uh, Sue O'Brien on the relaunch of White Bear Red Moon. That's the board game that launched Chaosium in the first place. Uh, and connected with that is working on Nomad Gods, which would be the next game out on that series, but we're doing a lot of the work together. And then um, also I'm working regularly on the RuneQuest computer game with Black Shamrock which I wish I could uh, talk a lot more about, but that I've got to wait until we, we have the first round of releases. So busy, I'm sure I forgot something. I, I, I'm, sh I'm sure somebody out there is going to say, but what about my project? Oh yeah, Lords of the Middle Sea uh, as well. <laughs> One after another. That's fantastic. Yeah. I have to dive into each of those, but let me to ask you something that's one of our viewers has uh, uh, spoken about. Um, is there any news on uh, the Pavis book? Yeah, Robin is is plugging along on that. He's submitted. Um, uh, I, I I can't remember if it's a complete draft or a mostly complete draft of the Pavis book um, has been sent to Jason for first round of editing. Then it goes to me for um, uh, Glorantha content and uh, additional revisions. So I don't generally I don't generally see a manuscript when it first comes up. It First, Jason um, uh, does his first round of work on it. And then I think Robin's already working on the second book um, in that collection, the Big Rebel book. So yeah, that's, and if, I, I've been play testing parts of it. Actually, you can see some elements of it in the, uh, uh, if you watch the White Bull campaign, that's on our the Chaosium YouTube channel. So people should check that out. You can get some hints 